put in the top five. Now, once we get beyond some of those guys, we're going to find some franchise mm. fits for quarterbacks like Bo Nix, Michael Penix, and Spencer Rattler. Rattler's Bucky Brooks back here with you. Uh, let's start here with Bo Nix. Uh, uh, Bucky, And wh where do you feel like he might fit best? Okay, so I'm going to pair him with the coach, Sean Payton, with the Denver Broncos. And the reason why I love this fit is because when I look at Bo Nix on tape, it is all about the processing, the timing, touch, and accuracy that he plays the game with. When you watch him play at Oregon, he plays it like a pass-first point guard running the break. He gets the ball out to his playmakers. He lets them go to work. He has the ability to high IQ to understand what the defense is doing. And then he just makes the right decision based on what they're giving. I think that is the right fit for Denver. It's the right fit for Sean Payton. Because we saw what Sean Payton did for Drew Brees. I'm not saying Nix is that, but Nix is definitely a distributor in that mold. And in that case, I mean, the Broncos might just be able to stick and pick right there at 12 and get the quarterback they want in Bo Nix. Let's, let's move on to Michael Penix Jr. What makes sense there? Well, look, when I watched him at UW, he had the most fun tape to watch because yes. he is a big play hunter. He wants to push the ball down the field. And I remember my time in the National Football League when I was playing for the Raiders at yes. the time it was Oakland. The late Al Davis loved the deep ball. And I can just see Michael Penix playing in an offense like that. When you watched him just go shot after shot after shot during his time at UW, I just think about the Raiders of old. Michael Penix would be a great fit because Big arm, big hands, uh, tremendous talent when it comes to anticipating the deep ball. He is a perfect fit for how the Raiders want to play. And, I mean, the guy ends up running, what, high four nines? Or four, excuse me, high four fours on the, great, great at, at the pro day? I mean, yeah, he's, he makes it, it would be a great fit right there with the Las Vegas Raiders. I love that. Let's talk Spencer Rattler here out of South Carolina. So here's what you have to understand. When Spencer Rattler came out of high school, he was to cast me out. He's a five-star playmaker who has a ton of talent. You watched him go at Oklahoma, then to South Carolina. You can see that this guy can distribute the ball. When I think about pairing him with somebody, I'm thinking about the overall room, and I am thinking about the New Orleans Saints. I want to put him behind Derek Carr because I think they have similarities in their game. Quick rhythm, ball comes out, being able to kind of dink and duck and just allow the weapons on the outside to do a ton of the work, he can do that. But make no mistake, this dude is a talented passer, doesn't have some of the a-level athleticism and tools that others have, but he certainly understands how to play within himself. You put him in an offense surrounded by the right supporting cast, this guy can get it done and probably can get it done at a higher level. I think he's had a really good couple of months in this run-up to the draft. Remember, Senior Bowl MVP uh, down there in Mobile. Did nice work there. Did nice work uh, at the Combine as well. So excited to see where Spencer Rattler ends up.